Hey guys, so this is a portable high-res DAC. Now the one I have here is by DD Hi-Fi in collaboration with Headphone Zone. So I'll talk a little bit more about them later. Let me just tell you first why you need a DAC for the people who are getting into in-ear monitors. So it doesn't matter if you're spending just 500 rupees to get your first pair of in-ear monitors or you're spending 2,000, 5,000 or 20,000. You need a DAC. Now, the reason you need this is because each of these in-ear monitors require a specific power to perform to their full potential so that you get the full range of the volume and the highs, mids and lows sound as good as they possibly can. Now, the inbuilt DAC we have in our phones, our laptops, our PC are just very, very cheap and they just do the job of letting the audio signal out. That is all. You don't get the full range of the volume. You don't get the full spectrum of the sound. So it's a very bad investment for you to get a pair of really good in-ear monitors and then not be able to listen to what it actually can potentially produce. This is where the DAC comes in. So this high-res DAC can decode really high quality lossless music and it can give you the power your in-ear monitors or headphones require to perform to their full potential. So you get the full range of the volume, you get the full spectrum of the highs, mids and lows, and it's a very enriching experience where you get what you pay for. So you're investing in Apple Music to get lossless quality sound, and you're investing in a pair of in-ear monitors to get or listen to those subtle nuances and get the best quality audio and sound experience possible. But if you don't pair it with a DAC, it's gonna be a very, very discounted experience, which just sucks. Very seriously, for people who are just getting into in-ear monitors, for you guys, it is an absolute must buy. And we are in 2024, when most phones do not have a 3.5 millimeter headphone port, they all come with USB-C ports. So anyway, if you want to plug in a wired headphone, you'd have to get a dongle and then use it. But that won't work as a DAC. So when you are getting these phones and you're going to listen to music, just get a DAC. Just get this high-res DAC and you're sorted for a very long time. Now talking about this product in particular. So Headphone Zone, they have collaborated with DD Hi-Fi, which is another company which is known for their exquisite craftsmanship for really high quality audio accessories and audio products. So they have collaborated together. Now the reason Headphone Zone has collaborated with DD Hi-Fi is to give us consumers a high-res DAC, a portable one at 2000 rupees. And that is just insane. So this can power any in-ear monitor you can throw at it, even larger headphones, it's going to perform just fine. And the audio quality you're going to get is what the in-ear monitor headphone that you've invested in, it deserves this companion. So even if you pair this portable high-res DAC with a 500 rupee pair of in-ear monitors, say you're just someone who's on a very tight budget and you're just starting off, it's fine. You want to invest just 500 rupees in a pair of in-ear monitors, pair this with this DAC. Trust me, the audio experience is going to be on a different level. And as you spend more and more and go up on the price ladder and get better and better in your monitors, trust me, you're going to get hooked. That is where a DAC becomes absolutely essential. As you can see, I have my uh, in your monitor collection out here. And this is not all. There is a lot more I have. I just couldn't fit them in this box. I'm not flexing, by the way. These are some amazing pair of in your monitors but none of these would perform or sound the same or the sound exactly as they should if I didn't pair it with a high-res DAC. I faced this because there was a time when I was using, I think I was testing out the Moondrop Chew on a phone which still had a headphone jack and I just wasn't getting sufficient volume. It was sounding extremely low in volume and it was a very bad experience and that can ruin my review process. That is when I invested in a DAC and that changed everything. And ever since then, if you watch any of my in-ear monitor reviews, you'll see I always suggest that you invest in a portable DAC. Nothing too fancy, nothing too expensive. Just something that can power these to their full potential so that you get the full range of volume and the full spectrum of the audio quality. The highs, mids and lows will perform as they should. So just a quick review on this particular DAC. I'm not going to bore you with all the specs. Rather, I'm going to leave it on the screen somewhere here. You can check it out. 
Now, this DAC, I have used other DACs in the past as well. I have a number of portable DACs lying around. This has a whole new level of quality altogether. The craftsmanship on this is phenomenal. It feels very robust and it's totally unapologetically metal. And this cable over here is nicely covered in a protective sheath. So your cables is not gonna, you know, get cut or anything with daily use. So it just feels very formidable. Now with this deck, you also get a small USB uh, adapter. Now that is gonna be used for your PC or laptop. So you can plug in that over there. It's got a female USB-C port at the end. You plug in this DAC over there and then plug in your headphone in your monitor and then you get high res music and it's going to work flawlessly. Now for Android users, this also supports a microphone pass through. So yes, you can use your in-ear monitors that have an inbuilt microphone and take calls on these as well. So that's all. I don't want to make this a long video. Just talking about a portable high res DAC. The bottom line is, if you're using headphones, in-ear monitors, bigger headphones, just invest in a portable DAC and thank me later. So guys, that's been the video. If you have any questions regarding this, do let me know in the comment section below. I'll try my best to answer them. Make sure to smash the like button if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you haven't already and definitely share this video with someone who is contemplating on getting their first in-ear monitor and they're wondering whether they should buy a DAC. They should absolutely watch this video and make a very informed decision. So thank you so much for stopping by and as always, I'll catch you guys very soon in the next one. Cheers.